Hi everybody, Army P here for Explorminate, and welcome to my ongoing Let's Play of XCOM UFO Defense. Now I have decided to push a couple weeks forward not showing you guys every small detail of every small UFO that we have shot down, and in doing so we have figured out the Martian solution. Our research now points to Mars being the base of the alien operations. The base is well hidden and contains the manufacturing and cloning facilities to fuel the infiltration of Earth. It also seems to contain a controlling computer of some kind that controls the entire operation. It seems this that the hive-like alien society has some kind of quote-unquote queen bee. This is their fundamental weakness. If we can eliminate the brain from the body, it will die. We can step up our research efforts before it's too late. In order to progress, we must capture the highest ranking aliens, the commanders, which only reside in alien bases and in battleships. And in direct response to finding out that we need to capture a commander, the most infamous and rare of the alien types in terms of their rank. We have developed something that can only be called three types of awesome. We have developed the Avenger. The Avenger is a transporter and combat spacecraft, the ultimate replication of alien technology. So what we have done is decided to take our best troops, in fact, all of our troops, and send them on a one-way trip to the alien base that we know exists the first alien base that we actually found in London, or I shouldn't say London, but in some type, somewhere in the UK. We're going to go there and we're going to attack the base full on assault with the intention of nothing more than capturing the commander, interrogating the commander, and finding out how we can stop this infiltration and invasion. The real problem is is that we're, they're able to out-manufacture the XCOM project. So we, we are now losing a war of attrition. We have to strike the head of the snake for the rest of the body to die. So I'm going to show you who's going to be on this next mission. We've got our nice Avenger craft. Holds way more than our previous Sky Ranger. And we are got the entire crew, Army P, Boss, Smite78, uh, Oxy, Amanda Rake, SF Jarhead, Silica Ruin, Sierra, Dog Me, Trump, Trudeau, Andrea, Laputin Machine, Red Shirt, Tanzian Power, Chadlin, Boris, Garland, and um, Toady Mackie Mac, who's uh, a new recruit. Without further ado, we are going to go to the alien base. The first one that we ever ended up attacking. We're going to take the Avenger and our entire mission from here on in, without question and without stop, no matter the cost, is to capture an alien commander. Avenger 1, are you ready to land near the alien base 1? Begin mission, yes. Alright, you bunch of shaved apes. Let's capture this commander and figure out what kind of juicy details these guys know. Okay, it looks like the commander, or the, uh, sorry, the uh, leaders and the commanders typically hang out over there. So what I'm going to do is, probably going to have Boris because he's got one of these shots. Sometimes they do hang out, the commander does hang out outside of that area, so I'm kind of going to make my sweeps go around. Uh, I'll pull one of my stun launchers over into the rest of the base to kind of sweep through and then I'm going to take the rest of the squad over here the idea being is I'm going to basically stack up everybody who's got a stun launcher send them in and just stun everybody Sierra's got that flank We're pretty, pretty much going to establish um, a smoke zone the whole idea being that uh, we're going to establish basically a defensive line between the two our two entrance points around this area here and then we're going to probe out from there so we won't get those long distance shots that we absolutely hate and the idea is that we're going to try to lure the aliens into our own arcs of fire here uh, 
she does have one, but she ran out of time. Let's see, animated rake. I'm trying to find out. Remember who had a the other smoke bomb? Richard Smite has one. He does not. Our commander does not have a smoke bomb, which is hilarious. But Oxy's got one. Good news. And he's got lots of time units, so that's perfect. Okay, Oxy, toss her in there. Can't throw there. Well, you can throw there, can't you? Okay, Mr. Trudeau. So we're going to pretty much... I think he's going to sneak over this way. Yeah, this is exactly where the uh, alien commanders or uh, commanders and leaders hang out. So we're going to take that blaster bomb that Silica Ruins got. We're going to breach this wall like a mother of Fava. And then we're going to get those uh, stun launching crew to stack up and run in there and pretty much just unload everything they possibly can to get rid of uh, and to stun everything they got. Anything that's standing up, it's got two eyes bigger than, you know, almonds. Anyway, Animator Rake, we're going to be pushing you through. I think we're just going to take stack you up over here. And finally, we've got Smite 78, our fearless commander. Or, sorry, it's our colonel. I'm the commander. Ha ha ha. Do as I say. Okay, so what do we got here? Make sure no one's around. We got Guardland, of course. He's going to be stacking up heavy um, with a stun launcher, so I'm going to get him to hang out over here. Also, we got Chatelain. Gonna bring Chatelain around the rear, make sure no one's... Looks like we've got a pretty good base of fire if you look at it. That's actually pretty darn good. We kind of... Our, our two pod, or two entrance points here, ended up being really good for defending a position. So if we actually get the commander to... If we lure the commander out enough that we can actually... Um, you know, knock him out, pack him in a backpack, and, you know, do what we gotta do. It shouldn't be too hard to extract the rest of the crew. Meantime, I'm gonna... There's Silica Ruin, perfect. So he's gonna sit right here, where he should. Kneel down, probably next turn we will use it to breach into the area to make sure we've got what we need. I'm going to take boss and I'm going to swing him around here just to see if there's any stragglers. I don't want my um, st uh, stun launch or stun bomb crew to get uh, flanked. Trump, I don't think you had a, a bomb. You didn't. SF Jarhead. Let's get into the war here. You know exactly what has to happen. No flanky flanky for these uh, bug eyes. Andrea's part of our Stun bomb crew, so she's gonna sit here and stack up. Red shirt. You know, for a red shirt, uh, sure got a lot of luck. And I think I'm gonna get you to follow suit. Create a nice arc base of fire, and finally, tens and power. And I'm gonna get you to complement the stun bomb crew, just because if they run out of ammo, they're gonna need some heavy power. Alright, looks like everybody's in position. We should have two, our two smoke bombs going off now. Ooh, wow, he walked right out. <laughs> that was, uh, ooh, that was some dicey dice. Uh, we should have one alien right there. Right, we do. Okay, there's Boris. It looks like it's a soldier. Oxy's gonna take care of him. Uh, who shot that? No, it was Smite, not 78. It's a good thing that he had enough. Perfect. All right, now we don't have to worry about that anymore. That was pretty, uh, that was pretty dicey. Putin machine. Okay, so we're gonna sweep around, make sure we got no other nasties hanging out here. Doesn't look like it. Just some type of entertaining seat. Ugh. God damn it. Same as here, we're gonna get to sweep around. Doesn't look like we can no, it doesn't look like we can go there for now. Okay, so Boris, I think uh, what we're gonna do is um I actually kinda think that I'm gonna get the tank to come down here. Because there doesn't seem to be much to like actually, you know, to search. Whereas, if there's any type of aliens over here, we should probably get the tank to scout that out. Everything up here looks like it's pretty much good to go. Okay, uh, without further ado, let's get this uh, stun launcher going. Alright, Silica Lurin. Oops, let's start, let's start with right there. That's always a good start. Two, three, 
and I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to take out this whole L section here you can see which will be call it 3, 4, and 5 pray perfect anybody hurt? no, Trudeau's good dog meat if you please Okay, perfect. We were able to take out that entire section. Oh, dog meat's down. We've got someone, something right here. I don't know what it was. Uh, that's not good. Uh, Trudeau's got a stun bomb, so he's got nothing. Poor dog meat, damn it. We knew this was going to be a risky shot. Risky, risky, risky. Um, wow, there's a lot of fire here. Animander Rick's kind of move up, see if you can see anything through that. Anything? Nine? You can see an alien where... Oh, a cyber disc! Hello! See if we could take this thing down. Oh, wow, I killed Animander Rick in the process, because he was up high. Oh, boy. This is turning into be uh... Quite the challenge. We've already lost dog meat and Animander Rake. We're gonna take things a little bit more on a precautious level here, trying to get this damn commander. Can't see anything from that side. Alright, boss, see if you can't move up and see what we see if you can see anything. Who else was that? It was Chatelain. And uh Stun Bomb crew, Tans of Power, I wanna keep you guys together. And I'm gonna get Smite 78. If you can't get anybody here. I don't want to move up my stun bombing crew until we find out what, uh, whatever that was. Oh great, there's another one of those cyber discs. Sounds like we've got the commander some movement coming out of the commander's area. I do need to find out what on earth is going on here. Oh my god, it's a cyber disc. Jeez. <laughs> oh, oh Chatlin's down! Reactive fire. Oh man. Can you get out there, Tanzan Power, and try to help out? Jeez, this place has just turned into a bomb. So we've lost Chatelain, we've lost Animander Rake, and Dog Meat. We still haven't even seen any aliens here. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna get Trudeau to move up. Um, that being said, I think I'm going to move my stun bomb crew up. It's time to get up and get into this thing. Try to cover the flanks as best we can. Uh, that includes view boss. I need you to move up. I'm going to be moving with... Jeez, um, I don't know. Let me get you reloaded here, Silica Ruin, just in case there's someone who wants to do something nasty. Uh, red Shirt will come and help you out. In the meantime... Smite 78, I think, is going to help out the stun bombing crew. I have a good feeling about this. We've got a good uh, good feeling. Except for this damn oh, Boris is over here. He's got nothing. I'm going to move up my, my flanking crew here. Oh, you can see that from there. Wow. It's quite high. Jarhead, to see if you can get a shot on this cyber disc, man. Looks like you got a shot on. 24. It's all yours. No, nope, apparently no shot on. Can Oxy see it from him? Yeah, there you go. Okay, so we've taken out two of those damn things. And we've been able to sweep around a little bit. That's not too shabby. Uh, we're gonna maintain here. I'm, I'm convinced that there's something over here. There always is in these damn alien bases, but we were at least able to take out two cyber discs for the time being. Um, okay, what do we got here? Oh, of course, some type of mutilated bath. Great. Hopefully the... I'm gonna move up my the troops a little bit because I don't think there's anybody else in this area. And of course, the tank provides awesome... Um, a, basically a bait for the aliens. I'm going to maintain this arc of fire. I think everybody's pretty much good to go. Gotten chopped up a little bit. Some of our most beloved troops are now uh, a little bit hurt in conditions. We've lost Chatelain, Dog Meat, and 
Um, and Amanda Rake. Stump Bomb Crew should be moving up. Let's just pray to whatever god or deity that you pray to that we got enough uh, that that commander's still in there. Oh, it looks like he's there. There he is. Who did he shoot? Oh, there's a stun bomb. Here's a stun bomb. Who did he shoot there? Okay, this is not good. Uh, Garland has been shot. He's got a single wound. We're going to try to take him down. All right, we were able to take both down. Excellent, Garland. Excellent. Now go get back into the evac area. Who's got uh, Who's got a medical kit? Do you have any ammo on that? He's got no ammo, so he does. He's useless anyway. I gotta find out whoever's got a a medical kit. Um, maybe um, Smite would have one. No, jeez. Hey, Garland, move move out as quickly as you can. You got a wound here. Uh, Toady, <laughs> Toady Mac. All right, I'm pretty sure that I got one. Army P does, of course. All right, let's get those wounds sorted out there, soldier. Took down two of them. One of them might be the commander, which is awesome. Okay, we've stabilized him. Smite 78. Let's see what we got. Navigator, which we always wanted because it gets the hyper rave decoder, but of course that's not good. And a leader. Ugh. That's not what we're looking for. Okay, uh, Trudeau, stack up. Oh, there's one right there. All right, boss, take care of him. Yeah, it was just a soldier. It was carrying a heavy plasma rifle, so it should be good to go. We are anticipating the commander to be holding the obvious uh, blaster launcher. Okay, move up there, Mr. Trump. Andrea. Need as many stun launchers as we possibly can get. Okay, red shirt, I want you to accompany boss. Always moving fire teams, which is good news. Garland's hurt. Cody should be here. I think everybody's pretty much where we're going to be. The only thing I want to do is take the uh, boot machine and cover Sierra. Oh, hello. That looks like a blaster launcher, too. Oh, man. I wonder if I can get, uh, I wonder if I can get that shot off. 42? I can't. Let's see if I can't get this. It actually looks like it might be a blaster launcher. Oh, wow. I don't, If that's the commander, I'm going to be an excited an excited lad. Oh, and look, a cyber disc. Lovely. Okay, I wonder if we can move up Oxy to get a shot on that cyber disc. Oh, he's already got an eyes on. Perfect. Come on, Oxy. You got one more shot. Damn it. Um, got no um, time movements. I wonder if I can get Jarhead up here. Okay, Jarhead, you can probably see him. 39, Jarhead. Let's do this. Not impressive. Okay, well, the tank's there. I don't know if we're going to be able to take him down, but we can always try. Oh, he did. Right. <laughs> yeah, life's good. Almost like it was disabled, right? Okay, uh, I think we're in good shape here. We were able to knock out quite a few of the commanders thus far. Let's just hope that uh, commander doesn't walk out of that. Oh, there's a stun bomb. And what is that? Ooh, that is so dicey. That is so dicey. Okay, uh, Trudeau. Okay, Andrea's become unconscious. Trudeau's become unconscious. Now, which one was that? Was it an engineer? A navigator? An engineer? I don't want an engineer, damn it. Knocked out two of our troops for this. All right, Trump. Pick up the, the blaster, the stun launcher, and let's get in here. Oh, there's someone else in here. Okay, there is one. We do know that we have at least one more to go. Uh, there's a stun launcher here that this... I wonder if there's any way to knock that out. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's not the commander. They don't typically carry blaster launchers, but... Alright, at least boss can now pick up... Oops. Stun small launcher. Not enough time units. Okay, we'll pick it up for next one. Okay, just cover arcs. 
Make sure no one else is going to come out. It doesn't look like it. Okay, red shirt. You're going to come around. Make sure no one's going to uh, sneak up on Smite 78. Now, let's see if this was a commander. It looked like he was carrying a blaster bomb. Nope. Damn it. I haven't killed too many of these guys, I'll tell you the honest truth. Most of what we've done is, uh, is stun them so far. Shame. Okay, so I don't want to go too far, just because, uh, like I said, we've only got one stun launcher over in this area. Oh, oh, there we go. I can see a, this guy's got a, st a blaster bomb on him. And I've got Boris over here, and he's got one round. Great. Uh, I'm going to basically use the tank. Yeah, he does have a blaster bomb. This could be the commander right here, taking a little stroll through memory lane. And I'm going to try to basically use him as bait so that he won't shoot after our troops. Especially these fine, these two. So SF Jarhead, I'm going to get you to pull back so you're not in vision. Same with Oxy. I don't want you guys being shot. I think everybody else is pretty much in good shape. Killer Silica Rune doing her thing. We've got someone on the second floor there. Of course, someone got shot. All right, uh, Trump. You're going to reload. Okay, Smite 78. You're going to identify the alien. Where is he? Looks like it's a... Uh, doesn't even look like he has a blaster bomb on him. It's probably not even... Yeah, it was just a soldier. Where's the commander? That's not good. That is not good. If the commander's not here, we're in trouble. Oh, there's an alien right here, too. Okay, Garland's good to go, but he's got no ammo for that bad boy. Alright, let's get that back in the backpack. I can't see quite what he's using in terms of... Does that look like a blaster bomb? Probably not. All right, Toadie, let's just take care of this. I don't want to... Yeah, it looks like it was just a soldier. So the key right here is trying to you get this commander. But to do that, I'm going to have to reload this. Who's got a better shot, Sierra or Boris? Probably Boris. The idea being is we've only got one shot to try to get this guy. So we, we, or we got to take uh, Trump and bring him down, and I think this is exactly what we're going to do. Um, the commander is not exactly where we thought they were going to be. We thought that they were going to be in this large, you know, hub, and they're not. So that being said, you're going to take everything you can here, um, boss, and you're going to make a run for it. You've got the most time units, so, and in the meantime. Red shirt's gonna swing around. And help out Smite78, who's currently upstairs. Alright, this has gone uh, not as expected, but we're still in decent shape. Merlin's still hurt. We're still getting. We're still sucking on a ton of smoke, so we've got lots of cover. And we do have. A, a, it's gotta be the alien commander. That's gotta be it. Okay, so we've got a bit of movement. I'm surprised that this thing hasn't moved. Okay, here we go. Horse is 51. I got a shot at 60%. Oh my gosh, we did it. Perfect. Okay, so that being said, I need to get Jarhead out here. First off, let's put a couple of heavy rounds of uh, delicious rockets right up this pipe hole here. Have a nice day. Alright, didn't work out the way I wanted it. Not uh, the end of the world. Get Jarhead to take out that sniper. Have a nice day. Don't line a fire. Just shoot him. Alright, not working out. Is that... Oxy, get up there and help out. I want that sniper out of there before we try to go and capture that commander. Nothing. And now Oxy's right in cover. I've got to take care of that thing. Who's got a good shot? Maybe Sierra? 
Oh, not good. We've got so many troops in, just in the line of fire right now. Can anybody shoot this damn thing? We're going to move Trump up anyway, but the army P can get a shot on. Seventeen. No, I got nothing there. Oh, this is frustrating. Well, hopefully we don't lose one of these troops when these things move around. Oh no, he moved to the second for the first floor. That's interesting. Okay, Sierra, you can get your first. God damn. Where is it? Well, the the tanks got to see him. <laughs> Jeez. This is getting scary because, of course, it's got to be the commander down there. We got to catch that commander. Um, twenty-one. Let's go, Jarhead. You can't do it because you had to move. Great. Um, Boris has got nothing, so who's going to be able to get a shot? It's going to have to be the tank. I'll just do it nice style, and hopefully, I don't blow up that commander's body. There. Okay, Boris, run as fast as you can. See if that's the commander. Got a whole bunch of guys in cover right now. I'm going to try to get him against the wall. Sierra will hang out next to the green goo. We've got Trump. I need you to move up with your blaster bomb. Okay, everybody else is going to cover arcs of fire. Who else we got? We've got Oxy. I, do, I just want to basically, if we can get, make sure this is the commander. I don't want to move everybody out of position because then we can be able to get uh, enough fire movement. We'll get our nice Smite 78. Get him to start doing some cover for us. With red shirt. I think we're in good shape here. Okay, we've got aliens on. Oh man. Okay, that was obviously have a nice day. Okay. We'll ride over the the, the captured alien. Boris, you better be telling me this is the alien commander. A leader. It's a leader. Why don't we have the commander? This is starting to frustrate me. I mean, how many of these things are left? Boris doesn't even have a weapon that's useful. Put in your backpack. Pick up a blaster launcher, apparently. Okay, I'm a little confused because everywhere an alien commander should be, uh, they're not, and it's frustrating because... Where's Boss, by the way? Boss, get in the war, man. I need you help. I need you over here. I have no idea where these alien commanders are. Alien commander normally holds... has got a, a blaster bomb. I, oh, hello. No line of fire. Okay, let's just see what we can do here. Let's pull Mr. Smite back a bit, please. And let's see if Army P can help out. Oh, 19. That's not good. Uh, you're not going to be able to help out, so that's not good. Um, boss, <laughs> get undercover, buddy. Uh, and red shirt, get undercover. Where is this commander? I guess I'll use the tank to scout some more next turn. Hopefully that Cyberdust doesn't move too much. Didn't look like it did. Idiot. Alright. Get her done. Okay, perfect. Guess we'll take boss. Uh, where are you there, boss? He's got the stun launcher, so I guess we'll sweep around this way to see if there's any other crazy uh, leaders. 
I mean, maybe it's showing up as leader, but it's not actually commander. I don't know. Either way, we got to clear out this this cesspool. Try to get these last couple aliens out because I can't imagine there's that many left. We've got pretty much the entire base established now and covered, so... Hopefully we'll get... We'll mop this up. Maybe it's just say, not saying Alien Commander and it's actually a leader. Who else is over here? The Putin machine. Hanging out, doing his thing. Okay. Doesn't look... Again, looks like we, if there is an alien in there, it, there's not many left. Maybe one. Hanging out somewhere next to the... Up here somewhere, maybe. Well, this nice dead end, I guess, maybe. Okay. Oh, there he is, too. Um, I wonder what kind... I wonder what... If we can get eyes on. Okay, well, we know where he is. If we can get boss up here. Boss! Time for you to shooty-shoot. This is a soldier. Okay, there we did. We did it. We cleared out the alien base, but it cost us three of our operatives. And I don't know if we actually got the alien commander or not. I don't know if it would say commander or if I picked up the body, but everybody who had a blaster bomb and their cousin ended up getting a stun bomb right to the effing face. Ticked off, man. We lost three of our, uh, our some of our excellent troopers taking out this alien base. And if capturing alien commander is not pleasant uh, by any means. Yeah, we don't have any stun bombs left, but uh, if we get the alien commander, I don't plan to stun anything. Everything's getting something directly up his disgusting alien tailpipe. So we lost poor Anamander Rake, who did an awesome job. Poor dog meat, and a young man named Chadlin, who hates farmers. Okay, I'm gonna get back here, and I'm gonna see if we ended up getting any of the alien commander. Navigator, soldier, what? Where was the commander? Alright everybody, I'm gonna sort this out by any means necessary. But let's just pretend I got the freaking commander in that last one because that was bullcrap. I don't plan to play this game and have you guys watch me go through you know, endless amounts of um, bases. So I might uh, circumvent certain rules. And we'll just pretend one of those leaders took something up the old tailpipe when it came to interrogations after waterboarding them like Guantanamo Bay and coughed up the alien solution to how we're going to get to Mars and what that base is going to be. So, intend for this to be the second last episode and the last episode of course will be coming up next when we take the fight all the way to mars take back our independence and destroy the alien menace forever this has been rmp and i'll see you in the final mission